<laughs> Hello loves, Latte here with a haul, as you can probably tell from Abdul. Okay, um, sorry for the quality of this video, um, working on a new camera, I'm on my webcam right now, and my room is, the walls in my room, because I moved, they're yellow, and I just realized that. So it's making everything look kind of yellow. I did my best to make it to the color, but it is what it is. Okay, so this is a beauty haul. So I'm letting all you guys know. Sorry. Um, so let's start with MAC. Um, I've been kind of out of the loop so lately, so I didn't really know. This is not for MAC. <clears throat> I didn't really know that they were having a... Um, new collection come out but I'm glad I went so now I'll show you what you guys got I got a foundation now the woman said this is a new foundation you guys know I don't really follow MAC very much so whatever um it's called match master foundation and you know it looks like this just like all their foundations kind of look you know mostly whatever comes with the pump um, when I first, when she matched me with this, I didn't like it. It wasn't that I didn't like it, I didn't like the way she applied it because it was really streaky. And I didn't like the brush she applied it with because it really just streaked on my face. But I saw the potential in it, so I got it, and plus I wanted to review it and tell you guys how I felt about it. Because she did say it was new, so I wanted to try it out. So my color is, um, yeah, and the thing about it is, she said it's not, it doesn't have like the NW or the NC, it just, it matches to your undertones. I guess that's what she said. So in this, I'm usually um, NW45 or NW46, depending on the day. <laughs> uh, in this, I'm a 7.5. You guys can see that. I don't know. You guys can't see that. Anyways, in this, I'm a 7.5. Okay. As well as that, I got the MAC Prep and Prime um, Skin Base. You know, and that also has a little pump. You know to put underneath your foundation so that it's um you know stays and everything i had been meaning to get this is this the package just glittery or what? yeah i guess it's just glittery all over the thing i don't well i don't know i guess i had something glittery anyways um the yeah uh, the mac prep and prime um base makeup base and I just dropped something. Okay. Now this is from their new line. The new line is, what is the, the MAC, the shop MAC, cook MAC, whatever. <laughs> this is the kissable lip color. You guys, um, I'm really glad I got, got this. I got the, the color I got it in is flaunting and this, Okay, yeah, that's pretty much the color. That's the color. It's such a pretty color. Like, a lot of times when you put things on African American, like, lips colors, you gotta kind of work with it to make it look right. But this, I love. Because it smooths out very well, and it looks just amazing just amazing it doesn't look like it's like not right I don't know how to explain it but I love this this is this is gonna be one of my favorites I think I should have bought more okay <clears throat> and uh, another thing I got this is so cute they're you know their packaging is so cute Okay. Um, a little lip gloss. It's the Tender Tone Lip Balm with SPF. And I got the Hush Hush color in Hush Hush. And this is the packaging that it comes in. Now, after the guy put this on me, I was like, 
I love it. I love it. The camera keeps <laughs> I was like, I absolutely love it. Okay? Like, it's just, it feels so good on your lips. And I actually got it on my finger, so I might as well put it on, right? Yeah. It just feels so deliciously amazing on your lips. And it all came in this little, a cute little Mac bag. Love that. Put it up here. Okay. Um, next thing, we went to Lush. Oh, sorry. Lush. Okay. I got some bath bombs and um, some bath bombs and some uh, bubble bars and all this stuff. And my favorite massage bar. I don't know what it's actually called. I just call it the strawberry one. Because it smells like a strawberry. And it looks like a strawberry. And it is amazing. Like a strawberry. You guys, I bought a lot of stuff in Lush. I bought... <laughs> I bought three sex bombs. Oh. You know the sex bomb bath bombs? I bought three of those. And these have become my favorite, favorite, favorite um, bath bombs because they're amazing and they smell delicious. Um, yeah, that's another um, sex bomb. Um, this, I got this for my niece because the lady had her play. This smells like it smells like bubble gum. Yeah. The lady had her play with this, like in the store, and she really loved it. She fell in love with it, so I decided to um, get that for her. And then this, I also got this one. I don't know what it's called. It smells like lavender lavender and like lemon and i really like it I like the way it smells and it's purple that's what drew it to me um pink mini is the one that smells like bubblegum the one that i got for my niece sex bomb i got two of those um i think the sunny side Yeah, this is the sunny side bath. I mean, the bubble thing. Bubbles. Yeah. It was very lemony. I don't like to touch it because it's so glittery. But yeah. So those were all my Lush stuff. Whoa. The sunny side. Sex bone. Okay, the purple thing was Phoenix Rising. So yeah. Okay. Oh, <clears throat> we'll move on to these two things I don't have a box for. I got an iPhone now, guys. My cousin bought me an iPhone for my birthday. Um, yeah. So, my boyfriend bought me a phone case. I bought one and then he bought one. I don't remember which one I actually bought and which one he bought, but anyways. We got these two. They're from Claire's. They're just like $10. They're really cute. Um, I like them. It's just the back snap on. So this one's Cheetah. Okay. And this one is I'm using because it says Valentine's Day. So, yeah. So that's that. From Calaris, as my niece would say. Now we can move on to Sephora. So Sephora. Okay, so let's start with what I already have out. Um, I really like flat top brushes for putting on foundation and for, you know, general application. So I'm always, every time I see one, I'm always going to try to test it out to see if I like it better than my e.l.f. one. So this is the one I'm trying out now. It's from Sephora. 
It's the Sephora Professional Contour Blush Bronzer Brush number 43. I love the way it feels. It's really soft, guys. It's it's way too effing soft, actually. Why does Sephora put stuff in here like it's a prize or something? I don't know. Okay, um I don't even remember what this is. <clears throat> okay. So apparently this is the Tarte High Performance Natural Naturals Imp Imp <laughs> Emphasize. I don't know. Oh. Okay. It's an eyeliner. <laughs> the black liner. I had no clue. Oh, and it comes with a brush. I I didn't know. I don't know. I guess I was I was just I just buy makeup, y'all. I'm restocking. Okay. And of course I got the Naked Two palette. <sighs> I ran out and got it as soon as I could. I hadn't been able to run out and get it when I wanted to, but I got it. I got it. I got it. Hooray. Okay guys. <clears throat> um, what is this? This is a lip gloss. I really love Urban Decay's packaging. They they really rock with their packaging. It smells really minty. <clears throat> Let's play with it. It's really magnetized. And this whole thing is like a mirror. Here it goes. And it comes with another brush, which I like. This is a pretty nice looking brush too. Okay. Definitely see some looks coming from this palette. Oh uh, yes. Okay. Moving on before I get too happy. Yeah. Okay. I makeup forever, which you guys know that I love makeup forever. Got there. This color, it says it's a blush powder, but I never use these things as blush. I will probably use it as a blush and an eyeshadow. Anyways, I always use eyeshadow, but whatever. This is number 75. This is a really, really pretty pink color. It's not showing, but it's really bright, like really, really vibrant. It's just vibrant. You guys, just, it's not even showing how freaking vibrant it is it's like vibrant pink it's just not doing it sucky 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 but um okay also makeup forever this is number 303 and this is like a shimmery pale pink I really like it it's like a it's coming off like silver here, but it's like a shimmery pale pink. All right. Yeah. Can you guys see it there? That's a bit better, but yeah. We got some blotting powder that's always necessary. Okay, from NARS. We have a blush from NARS. You guys know I'm trying to get build my blushes up. And it is not coming out of the package. That's what it is. Okay. It is um Exhibit A. Nas Exhibit A. So I can get it open. Okay, that's pretty much true to color. I know pretty much everyone already has had or seen or has Exhibit A. It's one of their best sellers, so yeah. That's it. I really wanted that. So I got it. I got it. We have another NARS blush. And this is Lovejoy. I like that name. Lovejoy. Okay. And this is more like shimmery brown yeah it's like a shimmery brown blush and i think you know this is i look at this more as like 
maybe a bronzer ish type thing you know but it's really pretty we'll see how that works i just dropped my brush okay and then i got some brush cleaner brush cleaner and that's about it guys uh oh well i got a brush another brush this this little doohickey here number 21 and that, that's about it that's about it for my haul and i'll see y'all later bye bye